on why Mexicans should not say the N-word. Because Emiliano Zapata was part black. Because Lupita Nyong'o was born in Mexico. Because Indian and black runaway slaves from Quilombos that fought as slave hunters for decades. Because they're they fill their prisons with black and brown bodies just like they did their ships. The criminal justice system is a new middle passage. Police brutality is the new genocide. Because Vicente Guerrero, the first black president in North America, threatened war against the United States if they tried capturing any runaway slaves in Mexico because La Bamba was an African song sung by slaves in the fields of Veracruz. Herman, I like hip hop too. And I understand that your favorite rapper drops his word every other line, but tell me this. How many times have you smiled every time someone's called you a beaner? Hermana, does it make you want to wave your hands up in the air like you just don't care when someone calls you a wetback? Come on. We are so fly, they call us illegal aliens. We are so sexy, they call us dirty Mexicans. You should not blame music for your ignorance when you say this word. Does it feel as if you have a cotton gin fan that tied around your tongue? Does your mouth feel as bloody as Fruitvale Station? Does it feel like you're a strange fruit? A broken branch, tangling, swaying, surrounded by clansmen and their children? Surrounded? Does it feel like you're a broken branch, tangling, swaying, surrounded by children cheering because there is one less of you? Hermano, hermana, they used to hang us too for talking the wrong way, for questioning orders, for rejecting white men, for acting too brown. And I understand that you grew up in the barrio, that it is hard to see a link between a black struggle and ours. And for this, they have given you number 13, blue and red, black and yellow, same tactics they used 500 years ago. They teach us now so that we can finish killing each other off. And I know that it is hard to see a link between a black struggle and ours. And for this, they have given you shitty schools that are waiting to spit you out. They invest more in your failure than, your, than in your success, but you are so much more than this. So much more than any news, than any truth that they can find. Your mouth does not need to speak as if it had a burning cross for a tongue. I know that you have it in your inferno for your, I know that you have an inferno for a throat. I have seen this. I've seen this when you laugh. I've seen this when you cry. When you raise your hand to question, hey, mister, what is the policeman keep stopping my uncle? And hey, mister, why do they keep deporting my uncle? Why do they keep deporting my family? I, I have seen this. You have so much power in your voice, so much rage in the ocean that sleeps in your mouth, but we forget about bridges. We forget about quilombos. You have so much power in your voice, so much rage in the ocean that sleeps in your mouth, so let the moon pull the waves to turn this water into a typhoon, into a hurricane that their guns and their walls will not be able to contain, and then they will know the teachings that they have tried so hard to educate out of us, but that our ancestors have always known that black and brown have always been and will always be beautiful.